Question number 15 says Holly says one third of this shape is shaded. Is Holly correct? Yes or no? Well, there's actually a couple of ways we could do this. We can't. What we can't do is just circle yes or no and have a guess because even if we are right with a guess, we've got to ex do some sort of explanation. So one thing you could do is to think about how many squares we've got. We've got three squares. Okay, so one, two, three. And if you take this shaded triangle and pop it over here, you'll actually get one full shaded square. So you'd have one full shaded square out of three possible squares. And one full shaded square out of three, if you write it down as a fraction, is the same as one third. So actually, she is correct. So we'd have to circle yes. And what you could write down is something like this. Explain how you know. You could say, if I combine the two triangles, I get one shaded square out of a possible three squares. Full stop. This is one third. And that would be a sufficient explanation. Okay. Another way you could do it, let's clear that, is instead of thinking about squares, you could actually think about triangles. Well, this square, this third square is split into two triangles. The third square is split into two triangles. So let's just to keep everything the same, split the middle square into two triangles as well. Now, if you think about triangles and count them, you've got one, two, three, four, five, six. So this time we've got six triangles, okay? And how many of them are shaded? Well, two of them are, so we've got two out of six. Now you should know if you've done simplifying fractions that if you're dealing with two sixths, you can half both of those, can't you? So half of two is one and half of six is three. So actually, if you half both the numbers, you will come up with an equivalent fraction. So two sixths is equivalent to one third which again matches what she's saying here, one third of the shape is shaded. So again, you would circle yes, and your explanation would say something like this. If you turn the middle square into triangles, it is out of six. Two are shaded, and two six is equivalent to, yes, you guessed it, one third. So that would also be an acceptable explanation.